Well, it's expected to be the new one stop shop for the city of Huntsville. The brand new city hall is set to open its doors in late April. Yeah, and as construction continues on the $90 million facility, the Huntsville City Council has finally settled on a new name for the building. 48's Claudia Peppenhorst joining us now live from the construction site. Claudia, the name is simple, but the road to getting there, settling on that name, not so simple. Well, City Council passed an ordinance to name the building simply Huntsville City Hall. However, one councilman was hoping to name it after a former Huntsville mayor. District 4 Councilman Bill Kling sponsored an ordinance to name it after Steve Hedinger, who served as mayor from 1988 to 1996. Kling says Huntsville is no stranger to naming buildings after significant city figures, and he didn't want City Hall to be any different. However, to name the building after an individual, Kling needed to get an opinion from the Attorney General, see if this would fall under the 2017 Alabama Memorial Preservation Act. While he was waiting to hear from the AG's office, District 3 Councilwoman Jenny Robinson introduced an ordinance to name it simply Huntsville City Hall, which passed three to two. She says this name is more representative of the community as a whole. We protected the integrity of the seat of government and made sure that we had a seat of government that was named in a way that it would reflect the great work being done by all the people of Huntsville rather than singling out any one individual. We're not even going to be moving into City Hall until next summer, so we still have several months to go. I feel like the proper process was not followed because I think we should have had all the information before making a decision on something like this. Now we want to know what you think. Which name do you prefer? Naming it after Steve Hedinger or Huntsville City Hall? You can head to my Facebook page right now, Claudia Peppenhorst, WAFF48, to let me know what you think. I've gotten a lot of comments this morning, and so far everyone has said that they agree with Huntsville City Hall. Reporting live in Huntsville, Claudia Peppenhorst, 48, on your side.